My friends, as a Clean With Confidence subscriber, you do most things better than other housekeepers. Washing your pillows, unclogging your sinks, and of course, cleaning. As far as housekeepers go, you are amazing. If you agree with me, why don't you give me one of these? <laughs> Moving on with the video, it is time we pull back the curtains, pop open the windows, and get some fresh air in the Clean With Confidence house. Because today, I'm gonna show you how to clean your window screens with confidence. If you saw the video a couple weeks ago, I showed you specifically how to clean the windows, but today we're gonna focus in on those screens. I'm gonna give you three levels of clean. Level one, I call it the D-Dust. And for this, all you're gonna need is one of these, a lint roller. For this level one cleaning, assess the screen, take a look at it. If all you need to do is remove a little bit of dust, take that lint roller and just brush over it two or three times. No need to take the screen off the window, you can leave it right there in its place. Did I just say brush over the screen with a lint roller? Roll over the screen with a lint roller. Now for the level two cleaning, if you gotta go a little bit more than just rolling over it with a lint roller, this is where we pull out the vacuum cleaner. I like to use a backpack vacuum cleaner. All you gotta do is take a brush attachment and vacuum over the window screen. The backpack vacuum cleaner is one of the best tools that I have in my clean arsenal that I use daily in my cleaning business. I use it to vacuum blinds, ceiling fans, floors, cabinets, you name it, I put it to use. If you do like the backpack vacuum cleaner and you want to know more about them, I will leave them listed and linked down below. Now for the level 3 cleaning, if you've got window screens on a scale from 1 to 10, 10 being the dirtiest, 1 being perfect, and you're like an 8 or a 9, you're going to have to remove the screens. One pro tip though is that just make sure you mark your screens when you take them off so that you know which windows they belong to whenever you go to put them back. Now we're going to have to use a cleaning solution, a little bit of water if you got a garden hose or you got a bathtub. Wherever you need to clean these things, we're going to need a cleaning solution and we're going to need some water. I'm going to give you two cleaning solutions that work. Just pick one of them. The first cleaning solution is to mix one tablespoon of dish liquid detergent with a half gallon of water. The second cleaning solution, and like I said, you're just going to pick one of them, is to mix one part ammonia with three parts water. One thing I should mention is that ammonia has been known to discolor aluminum window screens. So if you're going to go with the ammonia solution, just be mindful of that. So once you've picked your cleaning solution, you've got it mixed up, take your screens outside, lay them down on the driveway, take you a soft bristle cleaning brush, and use it in small circular motions to scrub those screens down. This will remove any caked on grime or mud, also any insects or bugs that may be stuck in those screens. And of course, you wanna scrub both sides of the screen, and when you're finished, hose them down, rinse off the solution, and set them aside to dry. So that is it, my friends. That is how to clean your window screens. In conclusion, you always want to assess the level of grime that the screens have to offer to determine your cleaning course of action. Regardless of the method that you choose, implement the steps I've outlined and you will be one step closer to becoming the domesticated cleaning savage that me and Mr. Fuzzball here know you are.